with that ticket, you can get a seat in the house there. Of course, you've got AA1, but that's the best seat in the house. You know, ladies and gentlemen, the world of magic has many moments that are, in fact, incredible. As the moments that you'll see right before your very eyes when you see the National Gymnastics, we'd like to show you a moment of magic now, which dates back a few years, but it is, without a doubt, I would say, undoubtedly, the most sense-confounding problem upon the stage today. Watch this very carefully. That's a buzz saw. A solid piece of wood that was just cut in half as easily as a hot knife would cut through butter. Because that blade, that 36-inch solid steel lumber saw blade, is made of the finest, sharpest, tempered steel. The blade is connected to a 20 horsepower motor there on top of the frame, capable of revolving our saw blade nearly 2,000 revolutions a minute. Therefore, anything or any one that would be placed beneath these whirling, razor-sharp teeth would certainly suffer the same result that befell this piece of wood just a moment ago. Now, ladies and gentlemen, as Madison said, that in certain parts of the world, especially in the Himalaya Mountains, they use hypnotism in order to stop the flow of blood during surgical operations. Well, during this next operation of mine, I will use hypnotism as I am about to saw a young lady in Madison. <coughs> With that blade, and in full view of this entire audience. The lady with the ticket? She's left. And may I ask for someone else to help me, ladies and gentlemen, our victim. Yes, I think it needs to talk to you. Here we go. Now we'll do this in a manner of hypnosis. Look into my eyes, relax. Gradually as I come back in from three, you'll become more and more sleepy. what the saw blade does to it. Watch carefully. Then I'll lift her up. I'll place this underneath her. Ladies and gentlemen, the wood. 
And the young lady watched her. And there she is as good as new, ladies and gentlemen. And that is indeed one of the most incredible moments of magic on the stage today. Now, ladies and gentlemen, as we continue, I would invite...